This is how a neurosurgeon drills into the skull. This is the Hubley drill and it's used in emergency situations with local anesthetic. First step is to find the safest point of entry, which in most situations is a spot called Coker's Point, otherwise known as the mid-pupillary line. Once we obtain our measurements and we mark the spot, we take the drill and we place it perpendicular to where we're going to enter the skull. Once we make our incision, we begin drilling. And just like that, it stops automatically. It creates a hole just big enough for us to place what's called an external ventricular drain or a catheter. Normally, this is a life-saving intervention that's typically done right at bedside. Now, this is just one type of drill. We also have a manual hand-cranked drill, but this one is a lot more fancy and has special sensors that will stop you from plunging into the brain. If you're curious about how the other hand-cranked drill works, leave a comment below and I'll make another video.